Blue, get out of there now. Blue! Blue! So we're going to give everybody 10 minutes in an enclosed park because I want to make sure everybody's okay. They clearly are, but we can start running around like lunatics. Get used to each other's smells and everything. Keep peeing on everybody's pee. So we've got Mama over there. Rex might have to go in a kennel. Only because he gets a bit protective of his toys. Lara makes Rex look like a legit. So. Oh. Rex, stop being a dick with him. <laughs> Puppies are like, whoa, we got some big dogs here. Are you checking out in here? You right, Caden? You're very quiet. And this is where I'm probably going to have a problem with these lot, the youngsters. Because we can get access to stuff. I need to clear it all out. Give me okay, sweet angel. Are you okay, my handsome man? You're missing your big Zara. I know. Rex, you are on your last chance now. He's not doing anything, but when he's irritating the other male dogs. I obviously can't leave it as chance leaving him in a communal area when I'm not here all the time. So sometimes, unfortunately, they have to go in a kennel just because I have to be careful. Larry, leave that alone, please. And the other thing is, is Rex can get a bit protective of his um, Snog Lena. Do Rex and Lena know each other? Because um, I'm blue and everybody else, because Rex was over here before he got adopted. I'm sorry, girl. I'm sorry, you've got all these irritating dogs. You'll be friends with them soon. Yeah? I know. You gonna be okay, Mama girl? Are you okay, beautiful lady? I know you are, aren't you? You're like, hmm. She learn as an alpha. Well, I guess we can let them out, let them run. Let's see. Yeah, right, you're going in a kennel for that. You ain't putting up with that lady. Right, you? I think Rex and Mama can go in a kennel. She's just nipped at um, Godiva for no reason. So I'm going to put these two in a kennel and then we'll let everybody out. It sucks, but it's the best I can do.